Okay, so this question is again from Electrical Machines 2018. Okay, this is two marks questions from Transformer. It says a three phase 900 kVA, 3 kV by root 3 kV, delta star 50 hertz transformer has primary resistance per phase as 0.3 ohm and secondary resistance per phase of 0.2 ohms. Iron loss is given as 10 kilowatt. The full load efficiency of the transformer operated at unity power factor is dash and correct up to two decimal. So first of all, let us see what is efficiency. Now efficiency of a transformer okay, at full load. So you see the formula that is there. Okay, so The procedure to find out efficiency is actually rated KVA okay into the percentage load okay or say if it is full load okay so that means 100% or per unit value is 1 if it is 50% load that means the per unit value will be 0.5 okay so we need to take that x value so since this is full load so the x value is 1 okay and multiplied by the power factor okay so here what is the power factor so unity power factor it is given okay so now why i am doing this is because this particular expression is output power real power okay so real power is load percentage load x into rated kva okay into power factor cos theta so that is what i am doing okay and what is efficiency efficiency is output power by output power plus loss or in other words input power so the same thing will come here with 1 into 1 into rated kva okay 1 into kva into 1 okay same thing plus the losses so there are two types of losses generally one is the iron loss and one is the copper loss so iron loss is generally constant okay so say p iron loss plus p copper loss at the rated condition okay that means rated uh, or, or in other words full load condition because it is said that you need to find this efficiency at full load so i need to find out the copper loss at full load if they are asking the efficiency at half load i need to find out the copper loss at half load okay but you see generally the input voltage is constant and when the voltage is constant iron loss will be constant that is why it is also called constant loss and this is called variable loss okay simple now you see what is given in the question let us see it is given that this rated value is 900 so this becomes 900 kva into one or just uh, you know 900 into 10 to the power 3 by 900 into 10 to the power 3 plus iron loss is also given as 10 kilowatt that means 10 into 10 to the power 3 plus pcu f so if we know this we can find out the efficiency so now let us find this so p copper loss full load now what is this how do we find this so this is a delta star you know transformer so delta star transformer then copper loss or the windage loss or winding you know loss in the copper okay will be both on the delta side as well as primary side or i mean delta side and star side or in other words primary and secondary side so you see so this will be p copper loss at full load in delta side plus p copper loss full load in star side so now let us find in delta side so in delta side this will be 
थ्री इंटू आई फेज करेंट इन डेल्टा साइड ओके होल स्क्वेर इंटू आर पर फेज ऑफ द डेल्टा साइड रेजिस्टेंस पर फेज प्लस दिस वन ऑल्सो थ्री इंटू आई फेज करेंट ऑफ स्टार साइड होल स्क्वेर आर फेज और पर फेज वैल्यू इन द स्टार साइड हियर इन द डेल्टा साइड so these values are given okay that is r per phase in delta and r per phase in star is given here what we need to find is this per phase value of star and delta side so how do we find this you see the well, voltage is given so in delta side okay in delta side i phase okay that means you see what happens in delta is this is the phase value right I phase current, okay, and this is the line current. So what we generally know is, what we generally know is, rating rate rated KVA is equal to three into V phase into I phase, okay. So we know that the rated value is 900. In the delta side, the phase voltage is same as the line voltage. Okay. So phase voltage or line voltage is given as 3 kV. Okay, 3 k. This is also 9 900 k. And I phase. We need to find out. Okay. So this k, this k cancel. This three is a nine. This nine cancel. So I phase in delta side is equal to hundred amps. Similarly, in star side, nine hundred k is equal to three into V phase into I phase, or I can write it as root three of V line into I line. Now we know that in star connection, the line line current is same as the phase current. So in place of I L, I can write here as I phase of star. Also, I can write. Now why I have done this? Because in the question it is given, V L is given. Okay. So directly we can write the value that is root three kV. Okay. So this becomes nine hundred k is equal to root three into root three k into I phase. Okay. So now this becomes three, and this three is here three hundred, and this k this k cancel. So I phase in star is three hundred. I phase in star connection is 300 amps. Okay. Now if I put the values here, okay. So I got the I phase value here for both primary and secondary. I'll just put the values. Find out the copper loss. So that means this becomes 3 into 100. All square into R phase. Now R phase A of delta is given as 0.3, and for this side it is given as 3 into 0.02, 300 whole square into 0.02. Okay. Now by calculating this, the total. Copper loss comes out to be fourteen point four kilowatt. Now, if I put this value here, so it becomes nine hundred by nine hundred plus ten plus fourteen point four. All the k are cancelled. So from here, I will get the value as ninety seven point three six percentage. Okay, that means into hundred I have done. Okay, into hundred percent. That is ninety-seven point three six percent. Okay, so this is the answer. 
Okay.